Good morning, guys. Today is a very exciting day. We are going away. We're going somewhere. We're not going very far. We are going on a little trip, a little road trip. I am so so, 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 so excited. We are heading to Montreal today. I haven't been to Montreal in like eight years and a lot of my family actually lives there. I always hear just the greatest things about Montreal. So I went there many times when I was growing up, but obviously I was young and I wasn't like taking in the city. I did go actually when I was 18 with Charlotte and a couple other friends and it was, a, it was a time. I did vlog that. It's five in the morning. Slow. In. There's a reason why it's on private now. It's just embarrassing. Anyways, this weekend is Father's Day, so we're going to see my grandparents that I haven't seen them in so long. So happy that we're all like fully vaccinated now and it doesn't have to feel scary to go see them, but I got to pack. Plan was to leave in 30 minutes. I don't know if that's happening, but I haven't packed at all. I did get some new clothes and I want to try them on before I pack them. So we'll do like a try on pack thing. Here's pile one of clothes. Here's pile two. So we'll start with number one. I need to like iron this, but very cute. This is actually a skirt. You can see it. it's shorts. Really loving the little pleated skirt thing. Oh, are there? No. Oh, ha! That's funny. I thought maybe there were pockets. This top, super cute. Obviously, it's freaking tiny, but I love it. I love the one shoulder. This is definitely not like let's go dinner with the grandparents outfit, but these are both super cute. I feel like this had a lot of potential, but it's just not. It's just not fitting the way that it maybe could have. Straps are definitely just too big for me. Shorts are maybe cool. Okay, so this one's unfortunate because from the front, it looks actually really cute, like a really nice fit here. But the boobs definitely don't fit and it doesn't zip up. So it overall doesn't fit at all. Did I get a zebra skirt? Yes, I did. Lots of like zebra right now on the cool girls on TikTok. And so I wanted to partake. I don't actually know how to wear this. It's not coming to Montreal, but. She's still cute. This is very cute. There's no back, but she's cute from the front. This is of course not coming to Montreal. I don't know what to wear. I don't know what to bring. I don't know what to pack. This top is awesome. It's awesome. I just need something to cover the nips. And then we're good. Then we're good to go. I feel like it's like perfect for summer. This I think is gonna come to Montreal. It's like cute summery, but not, like, not crazy. <laughs> not in your face, not like TikTok crazy. This is from Zara. We're moving on to the Zara stuff now. Please disregard the piles of clothes on my floor. That's just how it's gonna be until I'm packed. And if you don't make a mess when you're packing, you're lying. <laughs> I don't think I intended on doing a full try on haul here, but like this is where we're at. So this is another one. Like this is a super strange print. This is not typically something I would ever buy, but for some reason I was inclined to do so. And I I like it, I think. It's definitely a little weird. Like the print is weird, but I think it's cute for like a little brunch day. Yeah. This has been a lot of procrastination. I'm very low on time. I gotta pack. <laughs> we are packed up. I am leaving my place a mess, which I really try my best not to do, but I am out of time. I have no choice. It's okay. It's not like I'm going away for two weeks and I come back to this. I'm going away for like a day. I'll be back like Sunday afternoon so I can clean it up and do my Sunday things that I tend to do. But anyways, I have to go. The family's downstairs waiting. Since I don't have like a carry-on or like a duffel, this is my packing method. This is what we're doing today. I need to get a duffel bag. <laughs> We're back in the car. It is, it's wet out there. It's not the ideal road trip conditions, but I got a grilled cheese. I was gonna get this like biscuit thing that my mom got. There she is. But I wanted, I don't know, a grilled cheese was calling my name. And this one looks insane. Wow. Cheese on the inside, cheese melted on the outside. As good as you uh, hoped it would be? I think I hoped for maybe some like mayo in there. But you know what? A grilled cheese is still a grilled cheese. Always good. Right. <laughs> Okay, so we took the Tesla on this road trip. It's Neo's first road trip. That's the name of my father's car, Neo. We have 45 minutes remaining. I figured I would let you guys know if anyone was interested in how a Tesla is on a road trip. You never wait for the full 45 minutes. No. Because it charges very slow at the end. See what it's charging at right now? 850 kilometers an hour. We already put four in the tank. The Duco? No, oh, what is that? Wonder Word. Wonder Word. This is a pro move. 
No. It's a pro move. It has been many hours. It's now 6 p.m. We left at like 11.30. We've stopped three times for like a good 15 to 30 minutes to charge. So it's been a bit of a long drive. We still have an hour and 10 minutes to go. We're gonna get to the hotel at 7.10. It's been a long day in the car. I'm like finishing Harry Potter and I don't have the third book, chapter 17. The air of Slytherin. Can we turn the AC on by some chance? I know, really I'm feeling hot. a little toasty. Was fucking around when you turned it off. I no, you it's didn't. really hot it's in here. Maybe I don't feel any... now, every... now you guys are sweating it. Because well, it's hot. I don't know. Man. I don't feel any air. It's coming out. I can feel it. Okay. No, no, auto. There, trust me, it's better now. I know. Well, it's turning it down. It's gonna be fine. there and it's like a complete oh, brick road. Now your destination is on the way. Seven hours later, we're at the hotel. And I need to get myself ready because we're gonna go do a little dinner. We were gonna do dinner on the patio, but of course the weekend that we come here, it is rainy and dark and not nice, <laughs> but it's fine. Indoor dining is actually open here, which is crazy. So we're gonna go and get a drink and we have dinner at eight. Figured I would just set you guys up as I set up a little makeup station here at the window it literally looks like you're up here like i'm looking out the window looking at this rooftop and it where am i in the world just looks like you're up It is most certainly raining, but we are roaming the streets because I feel like I'm in Europe and it feels really exciting to me. Like it just looks like I'm in Europe. I don't know, this could be anywhere. This could be like Spain. This could be Italy. It's true. Barcelona. Like, <laughs> like it's Europe. Look at this cute little patio. This is cute. No, oh, this is so nice. I do. I wish the weather was gonna be nicer this weekend. Absolutely, one thousand percent. Nah, come on. We don't care. This is perfect. We don't care that it's raining. No, of course it's fine. Look at there it. Is. What? Oh, Mont Montreal poutine. At some point this weekend, we have to. For those of you who don't know, I actually was born here. Yes, yes. that's why uh, my grandparents lived here. Yes, right on I grew streets. up here. I moved to Toronto when I was 25. Do you have a game on up there? <laughs> Probably, should we go in? Upstairs and watch the head win. Want to go up? Well, how fun is that? Really? Why not? Let's go. This looks like a fun place to go. <laughs>
there's sunshine. <laughs> it is the following day. It was a late night. It was a late night. It was a fun night. It was awesome. It was a great time. We were all just like sitting there with our drinks or our shots. We just kept talking about how it felt like, just like we went back into 2019. I was looking around like, this cannot be life. This was so weird. It's gonna take a while to get used to like life. Just freaking weird. But it's another day. It is 10 a.m. My brother's in the shower. I'm gonna get myself ready and we're gonna head out for coffee and carbs. It's a coffee and carbs kind of morning. But I'm so happy it was supposed to be pouring rain for the rest of the weekend. It was just like a bit of a bummer. Obviously we're gonna see our grandparents, but it would be nice if we could walk the city without getting wet. So to wake up and see that, blessed. I had brie, mushrooms, spinach, and then the bechamel sauce. Bechamel. Bechamel, I don't know. But it was freaking delicious. She got a classic Montreal bagel, as one does in Montreal. As one does. My dad and my brother have wandered elsewhere. I, do you see them? Nope. Gone. Really, truly feeling the Euro 5. I'm sorry, I'm so annoying about this. I just really can't get over it. It's just so good. We just filmed it. <laughs> what it, she makes me do for her. Oh, it was fun. Come on, we got a good laugh. That was an embarrassing one to film. It's a memory now. You chasing me with the camera. We did the nobody, no. You, you guys know. If you know, you know. And that's it. My man, hello. how you feeling this morning? Pretty good, pretty good. Hello, hello vlog. <laughs> this is so bad. I did not mean to bring this along. <laughs> oh, I can't get over it here. Where the heck did we go? Yes. On the road again. Um, I scan maybe a little coat. <laughs> yeah, très bien. Oh my god. <laughs> I feel like a rock star. We are back on the road, another hour drive ahead of us. Just one night in Old Montreal and then we are now off to the Laurentians in, what, what is it called, Mom? Saint Sever. Saint Sever. Tonight we're getting together with the whole fam, grandparents, aunts, uncles, everybody. It's gonna be a very, very lovely evening. But Old Montreal, insane, obviously. But I'm just so happy to have sunshine. So happy. A little bit later. It's so cute. Look at this place. We are in the town. It is so freaking cute. This place is cute too. Everything is cute here. Everything seems to be cute here. Indeed. Give him the vlog yet? Oh yeah, is that so? Huh? Mask up. Doctor, doctor. Yeah, no, I've been playing it low key. The main focus of this trip is the grandparents. So it's true. Kind of just wanted to play the. Uh, hey vlog, what's going on? Oh my God. <laughs> Me and the boys. The side character role this time around. <laughs> Father's 
Wednesday. Gracias. It is actually the following day. I think I'm wearing the same outfit that you last saw me in. I don't know. I changed a few I, times yesterday. Outfit repeater. Outfit repeater. I didn't end up filming the rest of the day yesterday because we got together with the whole family, extended family and everybody, and just didn't want to bring the camera around, so we didn't, but we went to dinner. We were all together. Nice little family time. Now it is Father's Day here with my father, sweet Mitch, my brother, and my mama, and we are getting a little lunch in Montebello, which is very cute town here. Very cute little spot we're at and uh, I think I'm gonna get another crepe because yesterday's was so good and uh, I got crepes in mind so I think that's the move. charging spot number two of the trip. Also, I feel like I never told you, it took us a lot longer to get to Montreal when we first got here because of the charging. It's already a boring drive, so. It's like taking seven hours. Yeah. So we're at stop number two. There should only be one more, but we figured this time we'd get out of the car. Another, another stop? Actually, no, I yeah. thought this was it. No, we were supposed to get to one like an hour from here, but because Dash missed the, uh, oh, the turn, geez. we couldn't make it to that one. We're going to Dollarama. And uh, I'm gonna go look at the Nicky Knacks and then maybe the Starbucks that's over there. Ah, uh, that is cute. Or do we do the bucket hat? No, I think the cowboy hat is cooler. Oh, this is for kids. It doesn't fit my head. Yeah. <laughs> it's just floating up there. Fun. Oh, that's super cute. That's it. That's is this the one. It? Is this the look? We get one of these, a couple of those. Yeah. I think that's good. Oh my God, you have a cowboy How do you like it? I love it. It looks ridiculous. I think it looks great. Yeah, let's crack into the chips first, I think. Was it okay. Canada Day? Canada Day's coming up. I thought that was maybe today. We're gonna have a little Canada Day party, so we got some things. Also got some Hershey's strawberries and cream and birthday cake. I, my favorite chocolate growing up was Hershey's cookies and cream. It looked just like this, and we saw these next to them. So we're trying them. Oh yeah, and then we got cheddar jalapeno chips. Are they amazing? I was not as good as um. I don't know. These are pretty fire. I'm pretty content with that. Got some bite. They're pretty solid. But not so. Can I have a sip? How much longer are we chilling here for? Just wondering. Might as well leave. Yeah. Yeah. We were on the road by 11. So I'm very tired. We're home. The weekend was amazing. Loved it. Loved every second of it. Wish it was longer. <laughs> I'm so tired. And I'm gonna end the vlog here. Hope you guys enjoyed watching this travel vlog. It gives me so much excitement and hope seeing the world open up again and like life get back to normal. And I'm living for it. Hope you guys also had a fantastic weekend and I'll see you guys on Wednesday. Bye.